These are our new Prima Rub-On Foils. Eight different colors of amazing foils, each one with beautiful colors. These come with six sheets per pack. They're six by 12. They come in coordinating colors and they're perfect for mixed media, embellishing, home decor, scrapbooking, and cards. As you can see here, we've done a quick little home decor project with our foil. You can see how beautiful that gold foil looks. We added a little bit of our watercolor confections on there, and in no time you'll have a beautiful home decor project. Let me show you how easy it is to use these foils. So the Prima foils come with six sheets. You can see that they're all six by 12 and they're all in coordinating colors. This is the Holographic Dreams. This is a really fun set. When you open the pack, you'll find that each sheet is individually cut, so it's easy for you to place it on cards, layouts, any sort of project, okay? And you'll get a six by 12 piece of foil, and you can see here, there's a couple of pieces of this one and a couple of pieces of that one here, okay? So for this little example, we're gonna be using this one here. This one's really, really fun. I'm gonna be using one of our new watercolor panels, okay? These are really fun panels that are awesome for home decor. They come pre-punched, so you can go ahead and hang them on your wall, okay? And we're also gonna be using our new Christine Adolph rub-ons. These are adhesive rub-ons that you can use with our foils. So I'm gonna go ahead and cut this out. You don't have to be perfect while cutting this out. It's very, very easy and simple. So I have the word sparkle. That's a really fun one. I'm gonna go ahead and remove the acetate backer. And I'm gonna go ahead and place it in the middle of my watercolor panel. Just gonna go ahead and give it a nice rub. Our adhesive rub-ons come with these wood sticks. Perfect for rubbing the rub-on onto your project. So you just wanna go ahead and give it a quick rub. And you'll see that the rub-on will start to slightly change color and that's because it's adhering to the surface. All right, once we get all of those little spots, you wanna go ahead and lift up the acetine, you'll see that it's perfectly adhered onto the surface. Now I'm gonna take my foil and I'm gonna go ahead and place it with the foil design facing myself. And I'm gonna go ahead and slightly just rub it with my fingers. Of course, you can always cut a piece of the foil out so that you don't waste so much foil, but just for this example, we're just gonna go ahead and place it on there. And I wanna make sure that I'm rubbing all of the areas of the design. Now I'm just gonna go ahead and lift it up very slightly and I'm gonna just take a look and see how that came out. It's perfect. And you can see how beautiful and easy that was. And of course, once you have this negative, you can use that on a different project. So you can take another project and put it on there as a negative. You can also frame it in a shadow box. But then after you're done, you can go ahead and add a little bit of watercolor on here and just have a quick, easy home decor piece that you can hang on your wall. I hope you guys enjoy these Prima rub-on foils. Mm -hmm.